An introduction to ellipsoids, the shape which is as fun to say as it is to draw. A circle is all the points which are the same distance r, the radius, away from the center. Using Pythagoras, we can get the equation for a circle. The x-coordinate squared plus the y-coordinate squared equals the radius squared. We could, of course, divide both coordinates squared by the radius squared, and that would equal 1, which looks like a more complicated equation to start with, but it does now mean we can change the radius in each direction separately, sort of. Instead of a radius, we now have two different semi-axes, A and B. This gives us a more generalized circle, the ellipse. And, fun side fact, the area of a circle is pi r squared, and the area of an ellipse is pi a times b. The circle is just the case where a equals b. In three dimensions, it is all pretty similar. If all three coordinates, each squared, sum to give some constant, the surface is a sphere. But divide each by their own semi-axis, and suddenly you are in ellipsoid town. Fun side fact here, the volume of a sphere is 4 thirds pi r cubed. The volume of an ellipsoid is 4 thirds pi a times b times c. And as you can see, changing a, b and c gives an incredible range of ellipsoids. Ellipsoids! I hope you enjoyed that introduction to ellipsoids. It's actually from the middle of a much longer video about rotating bodies on my main channel, but I thought I would upload it separately to my second channel for anyone who just wanted to learn about ellipsoids. Ellipsoids! <laughs>